Today I would like to extend an open invitation to join us in the Home Tweet Home collaboration. This collaboration is to simply make your own or upcycle what you already have, a bird cage or a bird house. You can do this in any style you like from rustic to glam. Just make it unique and have fun. Throughout this invitation video, I'll be showing you Google images that I found to give you some inspiration for what you might like to do. I'm co-hosting this collaboration with my friend Indy Annie Jones. She's multi-talented and if you're not familiar with her, I know you'll love her channel. She's been getting us through this pandemic by crafting live every night on her channel at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. For your birdhouse or birdcage, you can use any materials that you like from cardboard to metal. You can make an indoor or outdoor birdhouse or birdcage. There are six simple rules for joining in on the collaboration. The first one is to include a bird. You can use a dollar store bird, or if you're artistic, you can paint a bird directly onto your bird house, or add in a little postcard with a picture of a bird in your bird cage. You can even get a jump start on your Halloween decor and put a crow in a bird cage. Rule number two is to title your video Home Tweet Home. Rule number three, use the hashtag Home Tweet Home. Rule number four is to please mention your host and add our channel links in your descriptions. Rule number five is to mention the playlist and add a link to that playlist in your description box. Rule number six is to upload your video to go public at 4 p.m. Central Standard Time on June 14th. Leave any questions you may have in the comments below. All rules will be in the descriptions for quick reference. I'll have a playlist link available on June the 13th on my community page. If you're considering participating in this open collaboration, comment below with the word tweet. Let's make this a super fun collaboration. Now here is what I'm considering fixing up for the collab. I've had this dumpster fine hanging on my back deck for quite a while. It needs a good cleaning, scrubbing, and painting. And I'm considering adding flowers and ribbons, and of course a bird. I also have this little bird house. This has been around for many, many, many years. Birds have actually built in this, so I'll need to clean it out, and give it a good scrubbing. Some of the mosaic tiles have fallen off, so I'll need to try to repair that some way. And yeah, a painting will be in order for this. Here's a bird cage that I did a little while ago. And here's a couple of hand painted bird houses that my sister gave me. So much work went into these that I hate to change them in any way. I'm looking forward to seeing everyone's projects. I hope you'll join in.